wiggling, wiggling. Wiggling. That's called wiggling. You got a wiggle chat. Mm. There's so many mosquitoes out here. Hi, Facebook. How are you? I hope everybody is having a fabulous, fabulous motherfucking goddamn gay Sunday. Hi. What's going down? What's popping? What's tea? You already know, this your number one nigga, Brandy. It's good. Real. <laughs> so, y'all, how y'all doing? Y'all gotta forgive me. I gotta open up one of these spa things because it keeps the mosquitoes out the way. And uh, it smells good and it moisturizes your black ass. I don't know about you, but if I ever get out of anything that has chlorine or bromine or um, semen in it, I get all ashy. That's just what happens, okay? So yeah, this is my little this is my little capsule of truth. Yeah, yeah. I'm gonna put it into the baptismal dip and I'm gonna have a QA with you guys today. Uh because um yeah, I'm blocked on Instagram again. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I got blocked on Instagram again. I think they just be waiting to block a bitch. You know what I'm saying? I was, you know, ready to start my weekend. Everything was going according to plan. And then that goddamn lizard looked at me in my face. Give me lizard emojis in the comment section. That lizard looked me dead in my face and I called him a nig. And I called him a nig in the comment section. And Instagram said, nope, shit, oh, you blocked. Damn. I was doing good too, bitch. I was doing good, but it was about that time they blocked my ass. Cause you know, they always keep the whole nigga bitch down. Uh, but it is what it is, you know. Facebook popping, YouTube is even more popping, bro. Like I am so impressed with the numbers over there on YouTube. So we're not gonna flinch a bitch. We never flinch a bitch. Of course, I'm gonna bring attention to it on Monday to let everybody know where they can watch the show, and I'll just repost the show on Instagram. It's no problem. And the crazy part about it is, every time they do this, like I can't go live, but I can do everything else. I think that's crazy. And when Shauna Brooks gets blocked, she can't post, but the bitch can go live. It's like. They're intentionally targeting our means of compensation, probably because we're not going through them to get compensated. And that's fine. And that's fine. Third world party, all that mess. Besides, in the next five years, we all going to be broadcasting in the metaverse anyway. And you trust in goddamn can't you believe I am the Madam Cleo of the motherfucking metaverse, bitch. You want to see why? Because I can wiggle. Watch this. Can your psychic do that? Can your psychic do that? Fuck. <laughs> but I'm actually happy to get back to my Facebook roots. And I've been putting a lot of energy into YouTube. <coughs> Excuse me. I've been putting a lot of energy into YouTube too. Um, and yesterday or the day before, either one of those days, they offered me a monetization partnership on my new YouTube channel. Yay. So we're doing something right over there. It's got to be that Boots TV. I don't know why that goddamn shit got so many views. And you know, I would tell you if I bought them. But I ain't buy them. I don't know where them 10,000 views is coming from. I thought it was Meg, but the video before that got the same amount as Meg's video. Then I thought it was my birthday, but then that video was the same. I mean, we're popping over there. So if you're not subscribed to the YouTube, I suggest that you do. At 7 o'clock, we do got a mukbang with my mom. And um, what y'all don't know is that we got into an argument right before that mukbang. When I watched it back, I don't know if you'll be able to tell or not. <laughs> So, you guys let me know if you can or you can't. I've been working all weekend. If you guys needed the receipts, they're in my Instagram story. 1,827 orders. I don't work by three, four for those. If you haven't got your order fulfilled yet, it's coming, okay? And my dick is not even though, oh my God. We're in a retrograde, right? Okay, so all my hoes is back. Or at least they trying to come back. But I don't want no disciples right now. You know I call my hoes my disciples. I don't want none right now. I'm good, okay? I want to focus on me. I got to keep my hair wrapped for seven days because we finna change the world with our witchcraft. The coven is tonight with the fire and ice spell. You know, I, I'm focused on other things. And normally the, the main thing would be dick, but I'm good because dick come with problems. 
Dick comes with drama. Dick comes with you not acting right. Dick comes with me getting sprung too quick. Off the wrong dick. Dick just too. Dick comes a lot, and then sometimes dick don't come enough. Sometimes dick got blue cheese around the circumference if it ain't circumcised. That's what you need to avoid. You know why? Because you're going to be wiggling. Now, I don't know why Mulatto decided to put Haley Berry, um, you know, the girl that's Chloe's sister, why she put her in that is giving boss video. When I think about Haley, I don't think about no damn boss. When I think about Chloe, I don't think about no damn boss. The other girls, I didn't know who they was, but I, I felt like they were some people that was pivotal in society or whatever. But have y'all seen that Mulatto video, boss bitch? Why is Haley walking just so dope faced and, and, and she looks like a, a da Bambi. That's what she looks like. She looks like she gives da Bambi tease. She walked in there. I'm like, bitch, this is boss bitch. Bitch, you better give me some. You better give me some. You better give me some. You better give me something. Don't give me what Nicki Minaj gives me, though. But give me something. I don't know. But, but the it was a cute look on her. Huh, but I'll say this about that video with Mulatto Child. The outfits were you. The concept were you. You weren't giving boss bitch. You, you, were, you were giving high quality productions. That's what you was giving. Which I can appreciate. Okay, I can appreciate any bitch that's gonna put energy into a production, okay? But but when I saw uh, Haley, Haley, whatever her name is, I started wiggling. Started wiggling. <coughs> I gotta stop smoking this shit, y'all. Look. This is my last weekend day before I start reading my girls full time, bruh. I am so happy. I am so rested. Let me tell y'all what I uh, done did. I done caught me some of these Ollie's gummies, O-L-L-Y-S. They gummies, right? And I got the kind for sleep. Bitch, I popped out of two of them. I thought I was on goddamn edibles, bitch. Y'all gotta stop sleeping on that shit they serve in the store. Just cause the shit is illegal don't mean it's gonna get you where you need to go. And my testicles need to go back into my swimming trunks that I strategically wore today because I can see Sally wearing all pink across the neighborhood right there. And I have a feeling that they are secretly spying on me and all this ass titties and dick. But little do she know, I will put it on OnlyFans and she can just subscribe and give me a little bit more coin on that mortgage they decided to transfer to another mortgage company. But that's not the point. The point is the video I just posted. Did you catch Sunday Inspiration? If not, Wiggle on the fuck up out of here. Okay, you better watch Sunday Inspiration. I just posted it too. Ooh, you know, sometimes the water takes me and the buoyancy reminds me of getting fucked in the ass. How you doing? And something y'all need to dish. Y'all know how to dish? Let me show you. All it is is your ass. Some of y'all need to spiritually dish. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Ooh, ooh. Oh, hold on, wait. Wasting water. Speaking of wasting water, did y'all know that this, this place um, in the United States that don't got clean water and their government told them to boil water and to take cold showers and to keep your, your mouth and your eyes closed when you take a bath? Is this America? Is this America? Bitch, I gotta get into politics because some shit just ain't. It's common sense that they went into it in depth about how, you know, the water companies are owned by the state, but they gotta get like contracted out to private companies who distribute the water. And after whatever happened, there wasn't no distribution going on. These motherfuckers need water. You need, how do, how do you need, we, I don't get how we can have uh, 50 states in the United States and we see that a city or a town don't got no goddamn water and we not come together as a conglomerate. Can we vote on this or something? Like, can we vote to 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 get them some water? I mean, what the fuck are y'all doing? I just don't understand. Some stuff is fucking common sense. You know, when I get up into politics, because I'm going to enter into politics in my 40s, I'm going to just handle the common sense shit. Okay, I don't want to be no Nancy Grace. I don't want to be no Amazing Grace, bitch. I don't want to run an Amazing Race, bitch. I want to wiggle myself into politics. Y'all know the move. I was trying to do it light, but you got to do it full out, huh? I'm going to wiggle my ass up into politics, and I'm just going to handle common sense stuff. 
Like common sense, Donald Trump, you don't need to be throwing paper towels at the people in Puerto Rico. You just don't need to do that. <laughs> okay? Like common sense, Roe v. Wade shouldn't even be talked about right now. Like, 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 <laughs> you know? <laughs> I mean, gay rights shouldn't be on the chopping block right now. If somebody kills a transgender person, why it take it so long to lock their ass the fuck up? It's a damn hate crime. The system is broke, but there's some common sense shit we can do to fix it. And if ain't nobody else gonna do it. I've done ran my mouth about everybody, including Tiffany Haddish and her goddamn sexual pedophilia. And just to elaborate on this, so I saw a wasp up here. Why every time I go live out here, I see a wasp? Squad, gang, and that live video from yesterday was from the gang. Um, from This morning was from the gang. Uh, what was I finna say? Mm, I forgot what I was finna say. I was finna say something, but I forgot. So might as well just wiggle. What does Jigglypuff evolve into? Wiggly tough. That describes me perfectly. Oh, shit. Mm. Anyway, but yes, some just common sense stuff that just needs to go down, and I don't feel like people have common sense no more. Okay. <sighs> but um, and I'm going to iterate what that common sense is when I get ready. Look. Housekeeping. Housekeeping? Housekeeping. Blocked on Instagram until further notice. Probably gonna be 30 days. At max 60 days. At max 90 days. Who knows how long I'm gonna be blocked over there. But that's okay. We're gonna get YouTube to pop up. Facebook's already popping and we never slipped a bitch. We never flinched a bitch. And the good news is I didn't go live on Facebook all week last week. So when I come live on tomorrow, I think I'm gonna go live at 11 and 9 p.m. just to get everybody adjusted to the new system. But I also got my girls tomorrow from 12 to 3. I cannot wait to see my girls. And if you are one of my girls and you need to see mother, mother is available. September is open. Only the first two weeks, though. Because ain't no telling how y'all gonna run my nerve. Ain't no telling. Because after I ain't seen y'all in a while, y'all likes to cry. And, and, um, and, 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 and ooh, and, oh, uh, and, ah, and wiggle. And I just don't have time to be wiggly tough all the time. Sometimes I want to get in a session. I want to pull a couple cards, tell you your future. It's going to be accurate. And then go about my business. What I was about to say was about that Tiffany Haddish. Look, I'm going to stand by my reading because my squad backed me up and said, Boots, you might have been reading the right thing. Upon further gay investigations, I have seen that it was not intended to be comedy, but comedy was the guise to bring awareness to a sexually assaulting situation. I am going to stay true to the fact that I believe that the parents had consent. <laughs> Ooh, mosquitoes. Ooh, woo. Hold on, wait a minute. You got to get... Anywhere but the face. Anywhere but the face of the lace. Hold on, I got to get some uh, buzz spray. Hold on, I got to get some buzz spray. Be careful, because that bug spread turned into Mason 2.5 milliseconds. What I was saying about Tiffany Radish and her mole, her mole is her radish. That's her mole. Her mole is her radish. That's what it is. You know, I had to talk about that mole, because I, you know, is anybody else witnessing how big that mole has become? I'm not even going to go in on that. Look, all I know is Squad said stay by the reading, so I'm going to stay by the reading, but I read that without seeing the disturbing energy of that video. It was awful. But I'm going to stand by what I said. I feel like the parents did consent. I don't feel like she's guilty of sexually assault, but I can see by that video alone how she's guilty of um, grooming. She's guilty of grooming. I mean, you was a, you was grooming better than Rapunzel in that castle. They ain't got no way to fuck out, bitch. You been combing that hair for a long time. You was combing them kids and grooming them kids. I mean, and that could have led to something else. But I feel like the parents was right there. I just can't imagine it. And maybe that's what makes me biased about reading it at all because I would never... Hold on. I had to make sure my hookah's on point. I would never just leave my children with an adult that ain't family. I just, I just don't get how people leave their kids with R. Kelly. Like, how do you leave your kids with R. Kelly? How do you leave your child with Tiffany Radish and her ho? You should have known by that mode that some shit was going down. That's what you should have knew. But I don't believe you dropped them off, though. I just don't. You ain't seen the video? Well, just scroll back. It's like, I, I pinned it to my to my shit, girl. You gotta watch the video. But look, I don't know, you know, I just, that's your baby, right? 
Right? I, and I don't got no kids, but I would love to have children one day when I'm 42 years old. But I... You just don't pass your child to the mechanic and go to the Starbucks and then come back and expect your child ain't gonna have no grease or no beast in them. I just... Hollywood is a little different, though. You know, they think different. Their mind is different, you know. So I can understand the misunderstanding that nobody else in the world has to what's going on. But there's something called Pizzagate. You know, it was about not delivering pizzas, but about sex trafficking in Hollywood. And, you know, some stuff they just don't want a nigga bitch to talk about. But I'm going to talk about it. Okay, take me out, bitch. I told them aliens I was ready to go. And if you want to plot on my black ass, I know where I'm going. I know where I'm going. I think by now I earn my wings, guy. I hope I have. Now, if you send me back to that goddamn black ass cable in like my bedroom, we're going to have, you know, I'm just going to have to, I don't know what I'm going to do. Maybe I'll come back and try this life again. But Earth is the most ghetto pit stop in the cosmos I have ever been to. It's ghetto. It's fuck. Okay, the people don't respect the planet. The planet don't respect the people. It's just too much going on. The politics don't make no damn sense. Lord, why did I choose to be at this next? Because I could have been anywhere. Where I should have been on Jupiter's moon. Fall, I give a fuck. Jupiter's moon. Jupiter's moon. People don't hear me. in my city. Anywho, bitch, I'm just coming to see what the numbers was going to give when I popped up here. Want to remind everybody we got a mukbang this evening with my mama. Um, and keep in mind, we got an argument right beforehand. I think we both held our composure together nicely. It's like a 30, 40 minute mukbang. <coughs> and this hookah is way strong. I said I was going to put extra weed in there so I can knock the fuck out. So, full time, what that mean? That mean I'm up at 6 now. I'm going to sleep till 6 in the morning. Yep, I wake up the same time I go to sleep, bitch. It's about time to bust these niggas. This summer was very reflective. It was a very much so a learning experience. I got a lot of clarity that I needed to move forward, and I'm going to move. Okay? Because when I move, you move. <laughs> and Coven is about to move the whole world. We're going to slow this motherfucker down a little bit. We're about to have people held accountable for their actions because accountability is free. But accountability is fleeting. What the fuck? How is something free fleeting? People don't want to be held accountable for the shit that they do or the way they make other people feel. Okay, you can't be held responsible for how you make people feel, but you can be responsible for your behavior. Sometimes you need to apologize for the way that you make somebody feel just because you claim to be of the righteous and a deacon and a bishop or whatnot. Okay, you ain't too righteous to apologize and you ain't too high to not beg for what you want. I got a whole begging me right now. Guess what I'm finna do? Wiggle. On that note, i see y'all tomorrow on live. Spread the word. Boots is blocked. Y'all get a post in the morning to clarify this fact. I'm going to continue having my head wrapping, not wearing any makeup again. Ate the fuck up by these mosquitoes out here. I love you guys very much. I'll see you guys at 7 o'clock p.m. for the mukbang with my mom. And uh, have a blessed evening. I miss you and I love you. Always. Peace.